Hi, this is an announcement. I am migrating my YouTube videos over to Vimeo. You will not find any more videos after this one being posted. I therefore will not be posting any videos at all over the weekend because I need to first move the series that I'm currently doing over to Vimeo and then I will begin posting again uploads. So this channel, this YouTube channel, is effectively frozen right now. And new videos will start being posted to Vimeo that are in the current series that are displayed on my YouTube channel page. Those current series will start to post again, but in Vimeo, sometime late next week okay probably next weekend not this weekend next weekend you know in other words thanksgiving weekend um now you might want to ask well, why brenna why are you doing this it's because i understand now what google plus is about and it is invasive of your privacy it is invasive of my privacy i need to protect your privacy and mine the Google people really just can't think their way out of a paper bag. They do not realize how what they're doing is very invasive and destructive to privacy. The reason why it's destructive to privacy is basically this. Anything you have that's connected with Google, they now want to create a unity so that everything you've got connected to Google is on one account. Well, that sounds real convenient, right? Until you read the fine print. Whatever you got in your Google account ends up porting over everywhere else in Google. Okay? That's not convenient. That's a problem. Let's say you have a Gmail account like I do with your real name like I do. And you go somewhere else in Google, like I did last week. Like I went on YouTube while I was still registered and signed in with my real email in Google. Well, guess what? They started to create a YouTube account using that Gmail address with my real name. Uh, sorry, Charlie, I don't want that. If I didn't stop it, it would have created I had to stop them from creating a Google Plus account. Now, how many times are you going to go through that process before eventually you make a mistake and you don't catch them in time and stop them in time? Because that's their new default, is to create all kinds of accounts for you across Google because you have one thing with Google. How long is it going to take for them to do that? Well, you don't catch it. Now your privacy is invaded. And even after you delete it, it lingers, okay, in the Internet for a while. The same thing happens on Facebook. You start up a Facebook account and you delete it. Facebook actually takes all of your email contacts and they write them, inviting them to join Facebook in your name, even after you've left. I know that because it happened to somebody in YouTube who left Facebook. And I got invitations to join Facebook allegedly from him long after he left it. Well, you think Google's going to be any better? No. So the only way I know of to protect your privacy is if you want to watch or comment on my videos, you got to do it in Vimeo. In Vimeo, I have the ability to control who can see your comments. I have the ability to control who can comment. I have the ability to control that your comments stay only in Vimeo. Or where, and if you want them to go someplace else, that's up to you, not up to me, not up to Vimeo. Vimeo is very big on privacy, okay? And if you want to link your comments to Google+, you can do that. I won't do that. Vimeo won't do that. That's your freedom. And so that's why I have to leave YouTube. It, it, it's basically, I've got to protect your privacy 
from the invasive practices of Google. And maybe you don't mind it. Fine. But I do. So I'm going to A, disable all comments in my YouTube videos, okay, to protect people who don't know any better about what's really going on. And that'll take a good month or more because you have to enable and disable the comments on individual videos, and I've got a thousand of them. That's the first step. Okay, the second step is that the videos are going to stay in YouTube. I'm not going to delete them from YouTube but I'm going to copy them over to Vimeo. So now you have the freedom to choose if you want to watch the videos in YouTube or Vimeo. Now the catch here is that if you want to watch and comment in YouTube, I won't know about it. Because as of today, YouTube announced its new policy. When you go to your inbox, you will not get notifications about people who comment on your videos. You have to be a member of Google Plus to know about it. They won't send them to your YouTube inbox. You have to be in Google Plus to know who's commenting on your YouTube videos. You see, they're trying to tyrannize you into being part of, you, of Google Plus. That's the handwriting on the wall. And I don't want any part of it. Okay, I was forced to create a Google Plus channel in order to stay in YouTube. But I will never watch that. I will never go to Google Plus. I will never respond to any comments made to me in Google Plus. I will never read Google Plus. I want nothing to do with Google Plus. Because it's invasive. They're forcing everybody into Unity. Unity is a, is a fancy, how do you want to call it, propaganda word for tyranny. That's what Hitler used. That's what the Roman Catholic Church used. That's what anybody uses. Unity, 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 unity. When they're trying to get rid of competition. And the minute you hear the word unity, that's when you want to run in the opposite direction. Okay? The word in the Bible that's translated as unity doesn't say unity. It's chenotes. And it means unity with God, not with people. It means harmony with God, not with people. It's a very specific Greek word that Philebus, the Philebus in Greek literature, Plato in the Philebus, has Socrates talking about. Chenotis. And it means God's system. And I did a video called God's system. And in Ephesians 4, 5, when it talks about unity, it doesn't mean that. It means harmony with God in God's system. In other words, you're not growing in Christ unless you're in God's system. So that's why my video is titled God's System. But in English or in history, when you hear the word unity, that's a call to, to tyranny. They're trying to get rid of the competition and they're claiming that they're the right side. We're the one true church. And anybody else, they're going to persecute. Anybody else is going to be an outsider. Now, I'm sure Google does not mean to do this. They're not thinking straight. Okay, fine. But until they are, I'm going to protect your privacy. And that's why I'm moving to Vimeo. So again, just a quick recap. Sorry, it always takes me so long. I am moving all my videos to Vimeo. It will take me until about 2015 to complete. I will not be posting any new videos after this one you're saying. And all of my remaining videos will still stay in YouTube. But I'm not allowed to see your comments unless I join Google Plus with YouTube. So I will not do that. I will not know if you're commenting. So I'm going to disable all the comments in my videos so people won't think that I'm being rude not to respond. And if you want to come to my videos or you want to comment to me, come to Vimeo. Again, the address is really simple in Vimeo. It's vimeo.com forward slash brain out. Okay, the forward slash is going this way. This way? Yeah, that way. That's it. And all of my videos 
are going to eventually be in Vimeo. And you can comment and be protected from Google, from having your comment post where you don't want it to post. And, you know, that's your decision what you want to do. Sorry this always takes so long. Again, I'm leaving YouTube in the sense of no more videos are going to be posted here after this one you're seeing right now. Number two, I'm disabling all comments in my current YouTube videos so nobody else can comment so they won't think that I'm ignoring them. And number three, the YouTube videos are going to remain in YouTube for people who want to watch them in YouTube. But I'm going to make copies of them migrated over to Vimeo. And I would invite you, if you want to get me to comment back to you, to come over to Vimeo and comment. And in Vimeo, you don't need to join the comment. But you'll see all that when you come. And they have better streaming, too. And quite frankly, they have a better quality of videos. No cat videos. Okay. No trolls. Anyway, that's it. Like I said, if you want to comment back to me, you can't do it here. You're going to have to do it in Vimeo. Peace out.